in the spring, things were moved slowly as far as what you guys were installing. The players caught it one term a day. How much faster has it been this week? I think it's been much faster. I think that the recall has been really good. I think that they did a lot of homework on their own over the summer. They did a lot of studying, studying because I really feel like they, you know, they want to be better. You know, they want to be good. And um, they took a lot of that upon themselves to do that this summer. So I think it's moved quicker, really, than I expected, you know, in the first four days. Coach, what's the status of the uh, weak side linebacker uh, position battle between Collins and Jackson? Well, uh, right now, Joe Jackson came out of spring as a starter, but we don't inherit positions. Uh, so we open everything back up uh, every time we do a spring practice or a, or a fall practice. We'll go in with a leader, uh, but that doesn't always necessarily mean it stays that way. So right now, that's where it is, but all positions are open. Have you found yourself in, in the new staff on the defensive side having to coach confidence more than you would in previous situations that you've been in when the defense was coming off a better year? You know, I don't think so. We don't really talk about that a lot. You know, confidence comes with preparation. Uh, I think that the guys feel like they're they're being prepared. Uh, I think they're doing their part to be prepared. And so I think, you know, confidence obviously comes with success as well. Uh, so we're starting all over. But, you know, like anything in life, if you're confident that you know what you're doing, then you're confident you can execute it. So I think that's more of where they're at right now. So we don't we don't even talk about that. Gene, what signs do you look for uh, to feel comfortable that the guys are getting it and understanding it at the pace that Well, they're having a lot of fun. You know, this is a grind, but we're still, you know, managing to have fun in the grind. They've worked extremely hard the first four days. I'm really proud of them. Uh, but they're, you know, like I said, their, their execution and their um, what they retain from the spring has been really, really big. So that tells me again that they bought into everything and you know they did their homework over the summer. They're having fun doing what they're doing because they're understanding it better and they're doing it and actually executing it better. Now we're, we've obviously got a ways to go, but if you look at where we were four days into the spring versus where we are four days into the fall, it's night and day. Fedora's talked a lot about your, your organization and your kind of attention to detail. How much how important is it to make sure that the rest of the defenders don't get freaked out with installing a new scheme with you know with just a few weeks till the first day game? Well there won't you know, everything we did spring wise was probably a seventy to seventy five percent maybe installation as we really went back and studied it. So a lot of this up to this point there's nothing new. There's been nothing new, and that was kind of the means to the madness. Now, there'll be a 25 or 30 percent learning curve on some other stuff as we move forward. Uh, but I think uh, the way we have the defense scheme, you know, it's just base concepts. And as long as we can say this defense is the same as, except for this one little thing, then I think a lot of guys retain that. Are there a couple of names on the defensive line that stand out to you right now? You know, fourth day of practice, guys are making a mark. I think Junior has really come a long way in his technique. Uh, he hadn't missed a snap. He's been really, really pressing hard every day, and his effort's been great. I think he's made a lot of improvement on the defensive line as, as the first name that jumps out to me. Okay, thanks. So when you look at last year's film and you break some of that down, where would you see as the biggest area for improvement this season? You know, it's, I don't think you can look at last year's and really compare. You know, it's just two different ideas totally. Not that one idea is right and one idea is wrong. They're just different. So it's comparing apples and oranges. So, uh, you know, we have to look at what we're doing every day to see where and if there are any deficiencies anywhere based on what we're doing. So last year's comparison really is kind of a non-factor.